I wasn't able to prepare very well uh, and uh, uh, and uh, uh, for now uh, I'm finished. Uh, I'm sorry for wasting your time. If you have any questions, please ask. I'll try to answer your questions. question in um, English so that we can avoid more confusion. Uh, my question is basically on um, uh, Kim Dong uh, statement that uh, we have a common Tibetan script so it's easier for us to have a standard Tibetan language. Now my question would be um, would be uh, what uh, do you think is the role of literacy and school systems um, in terms of propagating uh, a common language, because uh, you know, written language would be taught in school systems and literacy is part of it. Uh uh, I have talked about this in this paper, however, I was not able to uh, to touch upon that. Uh, and uh, I think uh, the uh, the media outlets uh, such as radio and TV are uh, are quite uh, pervasive in in Tibet. And uh, uh, for example, I when I travel in the car and I. I always listen to the radio and the people also at home listen to the radio and watch TV and the, the people who, who can play a role in, uh, in propagating the common language uh, are those who are working in, in the media. Also, um, also schools also play, can play a very important role uh, as, uh, when, when the teachers uh, adopt this uh, common language in the classroom. Uh, so, uh, uh, thanks for your very analytic uh, presentation. But my question is like, uh, the most important thing actually is like, let the government adopt your opinion or uh, the uh, language experts. So, uh, let's have an example. If we are the key member of the Chinese Language Commission, so you are the um, expert over there. So you want to convince us to adopt your opinion. So what do you think is the most key point which the Chinese government will really, really adopt your 
uh, idea. So uh, in order to convince the Chinese government to adopt this kind of thing, so what do you think the, the most important thing you're going to present to us? Thank you. ちちかしゃしゃしゃ。うん、で、たもでて、どうかってだ、この丸がなんかなんかなんかこんなたたんこんなたかなんかじゃん。読んでみて、で、てだ。これ、けて読んでんばが、スタンディーだり、スタンディ
Now, let me just uh, interrupt here. I think this is a very important philosophical idea he just said. He emphasized as long as a person is a good linguistic who will not against any language, for this, that person, any language is beauty. Um, so answer answer your second question and for the um, for the Mongolians uh, uh, living both in in China and uh, in Mongolia, they they always uh, pray to be reborn in Tibet. And the Tibetans are afraid to be reborn in in India. And the Tibetans uh, uh, pray that they uh, they will be born in a place near Hassan. Hmm? Hassan. Oh, near, uh, near, uh, uh, near, near Jurumbuchi. The statue that is in the Laza Cathedral. It's a very holy state. The statue is in the Laza Cathedral. It's a so it's very easy to answer your second question. If uh, if uh, that person is Tibetan, nobody uh, that person wouldn't say uh, Lhasa dialect uh, is not good, and I I object. So um, some people would uh, criticize. Uh, this and that about uh, Lhasa dialect, but when it comes to like uh, things like common, creating a common language, nobody would say anything against that Lhasa dialect. Do we still have time? <coughs> well, uh, we can take one more question. Uh <laughs> 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 Uh, okay, me, you can. Uh, that was I like meet really, really old friends since uh, and uh, <clears throat> yeah, because of old friends, we also talked a lot uh, regarding Tibetan language, and uh, he he was he was so well learned in Tibetan language that way keep change my idea all the time. That's why I think I'm going to do a lot of broken day, that's in Boris. Not that day, I'm going to ask you to do it. She's going to get all done, that's in Boris. Correction is that's in Boris, not cheap, that's a shattery. Not to unkiss a girl, not to unkiss a girl, it's not to get it. Unkiss they can name. We start such a mongol and wrote to Kundu, Kambal such a mongol and wrote to Kundu, Amdu Rangish Shemogosh. In a Hasaki Kenny, Amdu Rubuna, Pekali Kabore, to the Kabar Rubuna Kali Kabore. General Ko Tayon Denchiji, I mean, uh, before, if I remember correctly, Dawa is, Dawa's idea is Drupake, uh, Amdu, uh, also Amduke. Is good uh, dialect because there's a reason. When is Ropa, we say Amdoke also Ropa the same meaning. Nomads. Uh, yeah. Nomads. Nomads. <laughs> dialect. 
if you uh, spoke in uh, Nome, they like if you, you can go some part of uh, Vietnam, DAR part, big part, all Nome area. And also you can communicate in calm area, lot of area. Of course, no problem, most of the Amdo area. But some part uh, uh, with some case spot, go to Amdo, it's really hard to access to Amdo people. An area. That's uh, one reason I followed with him. <laughs> and the uh, second reason is uh, this uh, Jeff before Geshila made point. This nomad uh, the nomad, per se, dialect, Amdo dialect, it's really clear that each part of the world, the suffix, the per se, top per se, uh, top letter, and uh, all this, uh, most of the part of the, you sounded out, good for pronunciation or so spelling. You say Nivakari is not a Dutch Geshila Sonso, Amdo Keter in Kunta Kate Tunisiana, Kerseta. ま、どけてり。え、たじりくちゃ、ペナ、ランゴ、サンゴ、どっちにも、じじんじんね。こう、ちょっと、単語あれ。で、こう、読んでじんとしてくんと。で、ね、え、ね、ちょっと、ちょ
uh, he hasn't changed much. Right. Um, Amdo also has yeah. advantage. Mm -hmm. Like you read it as is uh, spoken. Oh yeah. I don't mind uh, which dialect uh, is chosen as the, uh, the basis. As I uh, said before, uh, uh, I can't decide. I myself can't decide. I, uh, um, so uh, I've been very uh, I've been consistent with my uh, my argument I've uh, made that argument in my paper as well in this paper uh, uh, and the reason the reason is cause, uh, there's a good reason for that and um, the reason is that like uh, many old uh, Tibetan texts uh, textbooks were based uh, 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 were writ uh, based or written in the uh, uh, the nomad speech in in which song? Uh, which text called the Gadam Lebam? Uh, Gadamba's uh, text. Uh, this uh, typical name. I think so. Gadam Lebam, Gadam Gadam Kiyagi, just some work. Then work. Which time? Tambaan Rupi. Can you tell us more? So in that book, <coughs> uh, it's uh, made quite clear that uh, the uh, the nomad nomad speech is uh, is the is the most compatible the uh, dialect. It appears to be. Oh yeah, then. That was Sudha Panchengara. You know this one. Sudha Panchengara. Work in the Gamu. What can we do? What can we do? Also, uh, another Tibetan scholar by the name of uh, Stephen Chen, he also made that point. He said uh, the most pure Tibetan uh, language was from the area that's, uh, that's uh, on the uh, border between Amdo and uh, Jarong. <laughs> So to respond uh, to your question, um, uh, If a uh, nomadic uh, language becomes standard language, then that's really much easier when he teaches uh, kids and uh, the children, and just he read the Zikhan rights, so easy. Okay. So, um, so there are two words uh, that uh, um, all the Tibetans in, in China know, and these two words are democracy and uh, a, and unification, unification. Uh, so, uh, democracy is for Jihira. The language, the spoken language is... Uh, 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 state language is unification, and the dialects are democracy. <laughs> 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 
그 다시 단어 단어 켜와 멍보 우선도 내가 켜와 멍보가 나도 그 지금 지금 매용도 매용도 지금 시끄 용도 인담다 시끄고 엄마소다 오늘에 엄마소 이렇게다 시끄쳐드려야 시끄다 이나 시끄지. So many uh, many uh, speakers uh, today have uh, uh, have said that uh, it's hard to uh, have uh, it's hard to have a common language. Actually, it's easy because uh, the common language is actually unification. Yeah, you have a unification that, that that's possible. If you do the unification, just say democracy, then that's hard to come to a standard language. Thank you, Sir Luca. Thank you, Sir Luca. Okay, so that's uh, for this session.